and it has been there for years and that has all been the problem. So we should, for once and all, accept the idea that is not viable anymore. Maybe again for short term, then again we have to go the same thing. And for so long that the people of Aruba, the employees of Valero were there, we decided as chamber, we're going to wait to see what Valero is going to do because we do not want to be seen as being harsh towards the employees of Valero or being uh, riding in the wheels of Valero themselves that uh, what they should do. I mean, they are a private company and, and they should have the same uh, courtesy and treatment as any other company in Aruba. And they have lev lived up to it. For, for what concerns the green that the government is promoting at the moment, uh, would Aruba uh, uh, prosper and, and benefit from it long or short term? That's very difficult to say, but at least you can strive to be green. And Mr. Uh, Patrick Newton of KPMG had made the case that it is not a luxury issue. It is preparing yourself for the future. And that's uh, uh, applaudable that the government is thinking about it. It is also long-term thinking, but we should move on. And one of the things, we are too much spending too much of time with the refinery in one hand and the green in the other hand. Let's pass this, close the chapter of the refinery and open the next chapter and really dedicate it. And that's what we should do. In your opinion, what would be then the next chapter? The next chapter is very, uh, is the green technology, but at least the refinery is gone and we start redeveloping that area with all kind of other industries and techno like a pillar of economic pillar and one could be the green technology and it and it we can be a research and development center for green technology I mean where there's wind water wind sea and uh, solar uh, and even other companies in Aruba like web is gearing up to be a partner in the whole thing so if you want to be a proving ground for your technology green technology we can be the proving ground the company like web is opening up itself to be partners in those things, to be a proving ground. We can gather uh, information on green technology here on small scale uh, islands and we can go back and sell those ideas to other islands. Those are the things what we can do. We should not think that we could have a major uh, industry here of you know, small boutique and small research uh, industries which combined becomes powerful and individually they can still sustain.